Hey everybody, I'm Jack Reedy with Future Pastimes. I'm a designer on expansions for the classic Dune board game, 2019 edition from Guild Force 9, the one we all know and love. And in this video, uh, which is the last video of Spice Week, uh, it'll be a relatively short one, but I'm going to be talking about sectors and territories in terms of spice. We will look at the board, but we're going to use my favorite territory for this example, and that is Wind Pass North, because look at how absurd this is this is a very small territory to begin with but the sector with the spice is this little tiny sector right here and uh, if there's a spice blow in wind past north it must go to the sector with the spice blow icon that's where it goes and if you want to collect that spice in the spice collection phase you must be in that sector you must be in the sector with the spice to collect that spice. Now, if I have forces in this sector of Wind Pass North and you have forces in this sector of Wind Pass North, we still battle in the battle phase. But if you win that battle and you have forces left over and there's spice over here, you will not collect that spice in the spice collection phase because you're not in the correct sector. So... Uh, I, I can't think of a reason why somebody would move to a territory but not to the sector with the spice. I suppose there are reasons. I can't think of any good ones. Um, I know, you know, there's issues with the storm. You know, let's say that the Atreides know that the next spice blow is going to be here, but there's a storm there. But they're not going to want to move over here anyway because they just get wiped out by the storm. Um, you know, there's other territories where that may not be uh, as big a problem, but... Yeah, they, they, they didn't put the spice icon in this sector because there's already a spice icon in that sector, and they want to double it up. And, of course, over in this sector, they've got this spice, but, you know, Wind Pass North doesn't even go there. So this is a fairly ludicrous uh, situation, and it seems to me that in every single game of Dune I play, Wind Pass North has a spice blow. Um, now, I've got much bigger versions of this board. I have... Uh, a mat that is about 15, 20% bigger and one that uh, is even bigger than that. So it is easier to get the forces in there, which is one of the reasons why, not the only, but certainly one of the reasons why I have a much larger play mat is, uh, is, is to get more room for everybody to really, you know, have the uh, elbow room to fight and then collect the spice. But that is a, that is a hard and fast rule. Now, this is certainly... Um, it comes up a lot in questions, and it's exacerbated by the fact that the Quick Start Guide has an error in there. Uh, it will lead you to believe that you don't need to be in the sector with the spice, but you do. That is a hard and fast rule. There's no wiggling out of it. You can house rule it if you want, but you would be a fool to do so. You, um, it's so It's so carefully calibrated. You need to be in the sector with the spice. The sectors exist, of course, only for the, the storm and the effects of the storm, but it's because of that that it is important for you to be specific about which sector you move your forces into. Now, if, if there's no spice, um, the sector doesn't matter quite as much. Uh, generally, you want to make a habit of trying to be as far from the advancing storm as you can get, so you can count it out. Well, it's probably only going to move up to six, so if I'm in this sector, of this particular territory, uh, and I'm in the open desert, I should be okay. Weather control, of course, could uh, make things difficult for you. But again, that's only one card, so it doesn't come up uh, very often, and sometimes not at all. Um, but in terms of collecting spice, you must be in the sector of that territory with the spice in order to collect that spice. So if you still have questions about that, feel free to ask them. Um, Otherwise, that's it for this video. Thanks for watching. Thanks for tuning in to Spice Week. Every other video that I did this week was related to Spice in Dune. And um, there, of course, is more that I could talk about it. So if you have questions or you have requests for other videos uh, about not just Spice, but anything, uh, and not just Dune, but any of our other games, let me know. Thanks for watching. We'll see you again soon.